One of the coolest parts of the Hellmaster system is the Digital Electronic Control, or DEC as we call it. It's got a selection of functions that make operating your boat easier and more enjoyable. Hellmaster Digital Electronic Controls are ergonomic and easy to operate and offer a host of operator convenience and control features. Throttle and shift functions are the same as with any binnacle control mount. Handles are moved slightly forward to engage forward gear and engine throttles are advanced as the handles are pushed forward from there. Engine RPM are automatically synchronized between the outboards through nearly all of the RPM range. Keep in mind that while doing this, the steering friction is automatically increasing relative to the movement of the handles. Conversely, bringing the handles back reduces the speed and also the steering friction. A master engine trim button is located atop the port control handle which trims all engines in or out simultaneously. Individual engine trim buttons are located near the fingertips on the forward side of the control assembly. On the front of the control are six push buttons, each controlling a different function. This is where the magic really is. On the upper left is the speed control button. Pushing it locks your current engine RPM, similar to cruise control on your car. But unlike your car, it can be activated at any RPM, from in-gear idle all the way up to near wide open throttle. This is particularly useful when trolling or running in the mid-range for long periods of time. Once speed control is activated, engine RPM can be adjusted up by 15% or down by 10%, simply by operating the center button on the forward portion of the control. It must be pressed individually, as holding the button will result in only one stepped increase, rather than a continuous increase or decrease in throttle. Please note that when speed control is active on triple outboard installations, the individual trim control for the center engine is automatically converted to the speed control function. Throttles can also be manually manipulated when in the speed control mode, and the throttle up, throttle down button function will be active from whatever setting the operator moves the throttle handles to. 15% up, 10% down. Pushing the speed control button again deactivates the speed control. Engine trim is one of the most vital aspects for proper and efficient boat operation. It can be difficult to set, especially for a new captain. No worries, let Hellmaster do it for you. Trim Assist is activated by pressing the button in the top right corner of the digital electronic control. When activated, the engines will automatically trim to settings pre-selected by the operator as the throttles are advanced past pre-selected RPM points. When pulling the throttles back, the outboards will trim down at the same settings. Full down trim is the first setting, and there are up to four trim settings after that. Note that trim percentage values for all five set points must be entered in order for this function to operate. These are quickly set up by first determining the trim angle values. These values are easily accessed through the 6Y9 Hellmaster display by pressing Menu, then Settings, then Calibrate, and finally, trim level. In this setting, operate the boat manually and determine the best trim settings for up to four given RPM settings and record these. Please note that you must use the full down trim as the first recorded value and that it must be at idle speed. It does not have to be set to 0%, however, that base setting is recommended for nearly all boats using the Hellmaster system. Once all trim values are recorded, stop the boat and enter these values into the Hellmaster system by pressing Menu, Settings, Calibrate, then Trim Assist. Enter the values you have recorded and then exit the system. Remember, you must enter a value in all five positions, and position number one must be set as idle RPM. The trim set points and their values are now permanently recorded in the Hellmaster system. Whenever this function is active and those preset RPM are achieved, the engines will automatically trim to your entered settings. 
Trim Assist will help ensure your boat is operating at the most efficient attitude toward the water. It can even help save you fuel and hassles. It's especially helpful when handing the helm over to a guest captain. Let's look at some of the other cool things the Helmmaster system can do via the DEC control box. If your boat is equipped with a second or upper station, you can quickly and easily transfer control of the system by pressing the station button. Once activated, a lock button will illuminate, indicating that the primary station is locked out and that the system inputs can only be accepted through the secondary station's controls. The three buttons on the bottom row can be activated only when the outboards are running and in neutral, and are deactivated again by pressing each button. The single lever button allows all outboards shift and throttle functions to be controlled via the port shift and throttle lever. When in this mode, the starboard handle may be placed in any position for operator ease and convenience. Both shift and throttle levers must be in the neutral position before the single lever mode can be engaged or disengaged. On triple outboard configurations, the center engine button allows operation of the center outboard via the port shift and throttle lever. This is helpful when trolling or attempting to balance operating hours between the engines. The free throttle button allows the engines to be revved up while in neutral. Although this is not needed for starting the modern four-stroke Yamaha outboards Helmmaster works with, it is handy for charging onboard batteries connected to the engine's charging system.